we've seen anybody do. They weren't on fire here at AGT. This is the biggest stage in the world, and there was nothing that was above and beyond or different or spectacular. So when it's not as good as what we've had before, I can't get excited. It wasn't interesting. Way too generic. You've got to do something better than what people have done before. It's been a very strange day. Seriously odd. Oh! Welcome to America's Got Talent. Who are you? Has the act started? Show. What was your inspiration behind that? Uh, we are from Kyrgyzstan. Our inspiration was when we were in our country, we saw Jabba Wakis on America's Got Talent. Yeah! So they inspired us to become a dancer. This was our dream to come to America's Got Talent. What you guys have created on stage is freaking amazing! Thank you. The movements are so articulate, impactful, and tight. I loved it. Simon? Oh, wow. It was just amazing to see your reaction to their reaction. Um, I always like to see something I've never seen before, and it's about imagination. And that's what you've got. And anyone good as you who decides to come on our show, I owe you a huge thank you. So thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Alec? I kept repeating two words throughout your entire performance. I kept saying, wow, and then I would take the W off and go, ow, oh, because <laughs> some of those movements didn't even look human. That is talent. Thank you. Thank you very much.
You were like machines. You came to slay, and we are deceased. So let's take it to a vote. Howie. Yes, I want to see more. Thank you. It's a yes from me. Yes. Thank you. Simon. It's four yeses. I'm Michael Paul, I'm a bird trainer, and I specialize in birds of prey. The bird I brought today is a very special bird. What makes it beautiful is also what makes it very dangerous. The beak, the claws, the wingspan. He is quite smart, and we have a particular bond that allows me to go outside certain comfort zones to try different things. Ow. But the other side to that is, I haven't really had him in this kind of environment. Oh. <laughs> she smells uh, the bird in there. Do you smell Willie in there? <laughs> Working with birds of prey, there are a lot of risks. Many injuries are possible and have happened. When I take off the cloth on the cage, how will the animal respond to the lights and the moving cameras and the crew? Even with training, it is not hard to trigger a bird of prey. If they're feeling like they are in danger, they might want to attack. I have two goals tonight. One is to make sure the audience and the judges are wowed. Hi. And two, that the audience and judges are safe. Welcome. Thank you. What's your name? I'm Michael Paul. And where are you from? I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Philly. <laughs> yeah. So what do you do for a living? I have had many jobs, but through all of that, I have always been an exotic bird trainer. An exotic bird, bird trainer? trainer? Yeah. Ooh. Wow. OK, wait, so what are you going to do for us today? I brought uh, one of the birds that I've been training for quite a few years, and I hope you like it. Well, without Thank further you. ado. Thank you. Um, I'm going to ask everyone to just have a, a, a slightly quieter demeanor at first so we don't spook the end. This is, uh, this is Willie. Willie, say hello. Say hello. <laughs> say hello. Hello. Very good there, very good. I'd like you to welcome Willie, of course, by saying hello, Willie. Hello, Willie. Very good there, nice job, okay. <laughs> This animal uh, seems very docile in captivity, but in the wild, he is known as a bird of prey. I'm Jewish. You're a little out of control, remember this? Uh, now folks, uh, when animals are in a new environment, the biggest problem is obedience. So what a lot of zookeepers and trainers and veterinarians use uh, is a little hypnosis. And this is not a very heavy trance, but when I say sing, he will sing. When I say sleep, he will sleep. When I say crap. <clears throat> Did that really happen? <laughs> this would be a lot easier if you just do more bird things. Hey, I'm a master impressionist. That's what my species does. You do jokes, I do impressions. I got it. I could do jokes. I'm sure you could. Could you do an impression? <laughs> yes, yes, I could do an impression. Go ahead, do it. <laughs> what? Do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> All right. I will do an impression. Yeah. And then you tell me who I'm doing. Okay. All right, let me think. King Kardashian. What? <laughs> you are tweeting without thinking. Donald Trump. <laughs> no. It's cheap. It's cheap. Animals, it's a crapshoot. Crapshoot. Mm, come on! <laughs> All right, now listen, I have an impression. Okay, I am not a professional. That's fine. All right, t tell me who this is. Ready? Yeah. Who's this? <clears throat> I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Elton John. 
I'm going to do one more and we're done if you don't get it. Fine. It's like the most famous person of all. Okay, ready? Yeah. Who said this? I'll be back. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Number one, it's Arnold Schwarzenegger, and number two, number two, mm, come on! No. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Simon? We got completely mugged, right? <laughs> I think there's going to be a parrot there. And then that thing comes out. I mean, visually, my son Eric would love it. So you kind of appeal to five-year-olds and me, 35-year-olds. It was fantastic. Julian, that was so much fun. I was laughing hysterically. And he was pooping. I actually loved it so much. Howie. <laughs> I think you just changed your life tonight. I do. You are so good and so funny at what you do. I love you. Thank you. So far, this kind of act hasn't really been my, my jam. But you made it my jelly, my jam, my apple yes. butter. It was so good. Yes. Thank you. Let's take it to a vote, Simon. I'm going to say yes. Thank you. Julia, 100% yes. Three yeses. You got four yeses. Yes! That was he hilarious. Was so I, uh, I'm so excited to perform here. Yeah, yeah. My name is Patrizio Ratto, and I'm a classical pianist from Italy. So what do you do to prepare for your performance? Yeah, I, um, I, I went, I go, yeah. As a child, I was very quiet and shy. So my mother put me on piano class, and I fell in love with it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm inspired by the classical composer, and one of my biggest inspiration is Beethoven. When I hear his music, I feel so much emotion. You can be angry, you can be sad, you can be happy, you can be quiet, you can be more strong. It's everything for me. Maybe it's because I've been here for 10 years, but I bet you we have a piano player coming up next. Oh. <laughs> Whoopee. I'm a little bit nervous, but I think this is a chance to show to the judges, to America, my music and my passion. Let's see. Hello. What's your name? My name is Patrizio. Where are you from? I'm from Italy. What are you doing here? What are you doing at America's Got Talent? Uh, I start to play the piano when, when I was young. Okay. And today I want to share uh, my music with you. Um, and with America. Are you playing an original song? No, it's classical music. Okay. Wow. Hope you like it. <laughs> Go ahead.
Thanks for watching. And if you like what you're watching, and you first of all, I want you to subscribe. So press subscribe. And if you want to see more, just click on. Uh, there's got to be something around here to click on. Just whatever it is, click on it. Enjoy.